Yeah, this your boy DJ Creed coming with you with another video. Man, it looks like another one bites the dust. Young Miami is ready to be in a relationship again following her breakup with Diddy. Now, let's just get real. Let's just be real. No woman can handle exclusively, exclusively um, being with a man and being his side piece only. Even though she may talk about getting the bag, doing all this extra stuff, how happy she is, how satisfied she is with the money, no woman on earth is going to be 100% satisfied with being the side chick. All this city girl stuff is made up. As a matter of fact, most of the popular songs made for single women are from women who were married. Let's say the single lady song. Beyonce literally was married at the time this the, the single lady song came out. So all this all this like hype around being a city girl of, of having all these dudes that's paying for stuff i mean i'm just gonna be real with you it's all a front it's all a big old front about being outside and woman empowerment because every woman could use a good man and every man could use a good woman now well, we're going to read some of this, uh, especially what she wrote on Wednesday on, on Twitter. Um, she says she's uh, ready to be in a relationship and love again. And this is her last summer being outside. I mean, if that ain't the craziest shit I ever heard in my life, it, I don't know what it is because... She took pride in 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 the show, Carisha Please, and 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 just being out there and, and making all these women believe that she was so happy with what she had. But in reality, we all know the truth. And and I hate to say it, most most women fall for it. And none of you women should be falling for it at all. None. Now, you know, uh, I guess back in April, she had an interview with The Cut uh, saying that she doesn't regret being so open about the situation. But the problem is talking about your situation being open. You, the first time you say something that Diddy may not like, he's going he's gonna to shut the, shut, shut the show down. He's going to shut everything down. And now... I heard she was getting like maybe two, three hundred thousand, a hundred thousand a month or something or something like that. Can't remember. But all that's taken away when that man feels like he needs to go on or move on. You know, and it's, it's sad. It is sad that it comes down to this. Like women aren't being realistic, you know. It's, I believe it's in women's nature to eventually settle down with a man. Now, men, on the other hand, I don't know. <laughs> men, I think, still always have that that urge to procreate. So, you know, men are prone to sleep around a lot more. But at some point, all women settle down. All women want to be loved by someone and have the intention 100% on that woman so call it what you want to call it i don't believe this city girl stuff at all every time they say there's some city girl stuff going down i don't believe it you know and and this is could be a lesson learned for any woman that's trying to keep a man you know it ain't always about all the money and, and being open and telling everybody your business because at, at some point it affects your business and affects your relationship with that person so i hope y'all really listening 
You know what I mean? But I will say this. Did he put her on another level? And it'll, I'll be curious to see who she dates now. She's probably going to date so far down that people are going to probably make fun of her because she was way too open, giving up way too much. And again, like I said in my other video, all that openness and craziness, you mess up your relationship for another man to come get you. Leave some of that stuff between you and the other person because it makes it harder for you to jump into your next relationship. And I stand on that. But anyway, what y'all think, man? I think this was bound to happen. Um, yeah, Miami, she's ready to get back out there. She ain't trying to date Diddy no more. But like I said, we could see this coming from a mile away. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe, man. More content on the way.